it's uh, go to the marketplace. We sell out some of this crap. Food's doing all right. Check out the tavern, see if there's anyone here to pick up. Don't want mercenaries. It costs too much. And nobody here. These guys are uh, just crawling all over the place. Uh, where did I say he was? time you heard about him he was in the field and he was close to Vezin where is Vezin okay he's just checking his property trying to keep those freaking sea raiders away there he is Oh, looks like I can catch him too. It'll take me forever, but I can catch him. Shape shit. Now this guy I like. He uh he knows that I'm not uh, not a nobleman or anything like that, but he still respects that uh, I uh, could end up being something. <laughs> well, that's that. Continues heading this way too, it gets me back closer to home. Can I chase these guys down? Oh no, they're way too fast. <laughs> they're fighting farmers? I'm not gonna allow that. Only four of them. We got this. Friggin' run them down. There we go.
sure why not Let's uh, upgrade our troops. All right, now we're looking at a weekly cost of 430 bucks. Mm, that's not good. But I'm sure I can make do. Keep going. Swadia and Kenneth made peace. Doesn't revolve around me, I don't give a shit. Looks like he's gonna be. Uh, looks like he's gonna get his face raped. Oh, unless he can outrun them. Oh, looks like he did. Lucky bastard. Wait, who else going here? Eric and Harold. Okay. Head back to Sargoth. Whoa, wait a minute. I'm sure one of my I'm sure one of these guys is probably uh, who I'm looking for. Yeah, Logerson. <laughs> They're sending the war party. Okay. Oh yeah, I already turned it in, so it doesn't really make much of a difference. Have any task money? No. Anyone have any tasks for me? Here we go. As it happens. I promised King Ragnar that I would hire a company of mercenaries for an upcoming campaign. I'm interested. Tell me more. I can offer you a contract for one month. At the end, uh, at the end of this period, it can be extended on a monthly basis. An initial sum of 300 dinars will be paid uh, to you to seal the contract. After that, you'll receive wages from King Ragnar each week according to the number and quality of soldiers in your company. You still have your rights to battlefield loot and salvage, as well as any prisoners you capture. Hmm. Or it can be very profitable at times. That it can, and I am looking forward to it. Okay, yeah, some questions here. Only noble vassals can uh, carry their own banners. Uh, can I hold castles I take? Only loyal vassals of King Ragnar can own lands and castles. You understand a simple mercenary cannot be trusted with such responsibility. So, yeah. 
what, what about my duties as a mercenary? Duties, there are only a few, none of them difficult. The very first thing is to declare your allegiance, an oath of loyalty to our cause. Once that's done, you shall be required uh, to fulfill certain responsibilities. You'll participate in military campaigns, fulfill any duties given to you by your commanders, and most of all, you shall attack the enemies of our kingdom wherever you might find them. Okay, so basically this uh, seals the deal here. Uh, this means I can now attack the uh, beggars and they can attack me. Uh, but if I can stick with these guys and back them up, then uh, we should be all right. It'll keep my troops morale high, and um, I, as long as I keep allies nearby, then I'm good. <laughs> so as of right now, I think I'll do this. Perfect. Of course, you shall have to make a formal declaration of allegiance and give your oath that you and your company will remain in service to Kingdom of Nords for a period of no less than one month. As you wish, your enemies are my enemies. Right on. There we go. So now we have. Uh, so now we have some steady income. Which should pay for my uh, pay for my troops for the most part. So uh, yeah, prepare for a serious campaign. Equip your soldiers as best you can. In the meantime, and respond quickly when you are summoned for duty. Okay, I must beg my leave. Where is the king? Let's get this done. We meet again, Billy Bosworth. <laughs> Do you have any tasks for me? Two of my soldiers were captured in a skirmish. He wants me to take Vager footmen prisoners. Hmm. What the hell, I'll give it a shot. I'll just ride with these guys and hope for the best. Now, let me see here. Do I need... Okay. I guess I already did the whole oath thing, so I don't need to worry about that anymore. All right, what's going on here? Everyone's going back home? What, the war is over? <laughs> okay. Dude advanced in level. Talk with him. What can you tell me about your skills? Hmm. Let's see, what does leadership require? Actually, uh, increases the tier. Charisma is the base. Okay. I think I will make this dude my um, my army builder. It's basically with um, every point of leadership that I have, I gain. I can have a bigger army. So, 
yeah, I'll start working that up. Uh, what kind of weapons is this guy brandishing? This looks like a sword. Let me see his equipment as well. A short sword and that's it. I'll give him the Nordic sword. Give him a bit of an upgrade. And he can have some throwing axes. Or maybe he can't. Well, suits me. I should get him some better gear too. I'll kill some sea raiders and upgrade his gear some so he doesn't keep dying on me. Okay, and that should be that for now. Morale is above average. Or, oh, it's average. Ugh. Let's head back to town real quick. Sell off what I uh, have here. Get a little bit more bread. Well, that is that for now. I, uh, I have to get ready for work, and i am uh, also been getting really addicted to a new game uh, called uh, Magicka. That, oh, that game is a ball and a half. I'll have to make some videos on that. Anyways, that's it for now. Um, until next time, have a good one.